already with all the antics up it. <laughs> Crocky, mate! <laughs> <laughs> you almost look Australian. Oh my well. goodness. Look at that stash. Well, it's gonna be such a fun day. My brother is here, mom and dad are here. We're gonna have like the best beach day. We're going down to Garden City and I think Bunky and my brother, maybe me and mom, we're gonna go fishing off the pier. They've been wanting to do that. And we actually haven't done that since we moved here. So mm -mm. I'm excited. My papa used to always go fishing off of a pier. So it like, you know, holds a special place in my heart. Um, and then we're gonna go eat this place called Sam's Corner. And when Bunky and I were in high school, we used to come down to Garden City with our church youth group. This is like when we were in love, you know? We're still we're in love. We're still in love, but you know, when we fell in love. And um, we used to go to Sam's Corner. They have like the best hot dogs and cheeseburgers. It's like a little hole in the wall place. And so we're gonna go there for lunch. I think Jacob wants to possibly do putt putt. We're not sure about that. We're gonna grill out later today. It's just gonna be such a fun day. And I'm just so excited to get to spend some like really good quality time with my family. And then we're hitting the road for our RV trip. Like we got a lot to do, a lot to pack we still. <laughs> it's gonna be a really busy day. And then you drop it in when it's closed so that it actually lands. So it hesitates just a, just a little bit, right?
Yeah. So good. Just as good as you remember. Uh, here we go. And that horseradish is clear. Get <laughs> We're going fishing? We're going fishing. We're going to catch a big one. Monkey, tonight is the night. I hope so, babe. We're going to get one. I hope so. So much for surf fishing, we're going pier fishing. <laughs> There is something just so cool to see the ocean at nighttime from the pier. It's beautiful. sitting here getting ready but y'all I had the best day yesterday it was the most fun ever I feel like a little kid again like playing all those arcade games and then going fishing on the pier last night and it's so cool because like we used to do that growing up as a family and then to go back to that same place that we used to go to all together and we all live like in different places now but to get to be together and do that again it was just the best like the whole day i was just grinning from ear to ear so anyway we had so much fun but i'm getting ready this morning bunky and i are actually about to go pick up the rv here in just a little bit we leave tomorrow for our trip and then mom and jacob are out crabbing and dad's downstairs working so anyway it's going to be such a fun next couple of days too although we have a very very long travel day which i'm a wee bit nervous about but it's gonna be just fine um but as i'm getting ready i want to share some of my favorite dime beauty products with you guys you have heard me talk about dime before i love so many of their products i'm going to show y'all how many of their products i have because they're just so good they're like clean great luxurious like skincare beauty products perfumes but at an affordable price y'all I gotta just start with my perfume, okay? This perfume, it smells so good. When I wear this, Bunky's like, oh, you got your perfume on again. It's the best, okay? So it is their Seven Summers Perfume. Y'all, I'm gonna read you the description, okay? All right, top notes are juicy pear, champagne, and warm sugar. The middle notes are lavender, vanilla, and praline. And the base notes is a woody musk, coconut cream, and bergamot. Oh my gosh. It is just like summer in a bottle. I cannot even explain it. Oh, it's the best perfume. Also clean ingredients. It is like hypoallergenic. I cannot recommend <laughs> this perfume enough. Okay, now let's talk about skincare. So this is like their daily SPF 30, and I'll put this on if we're gonna go like to the pool or to the beach, but I love the one that has like a little tint to it. So especially during the summer, I want something like really lightweight, not heavy, that I can wear every day, but that still like evens out my skin tone. And that's what this is. Um, it's non-greasy. You know, sometimes sunscreens can leave like that white kind of cap on your skin this does not you can just rub it in with your hands or with a brush but it literally leaves your skin dewy and just so beautiful it's made with 19% zinc I just pop it on in the morning with a little bit of concealer and I get my protection for the day I have a pretty glow skin tones evened out it is just like an easy product that I have been really loving this summer and the last down beauty product I want to talk to y'all about is their eyebrow serum I have been using this for at least 
two years. It is probably my favorite <laughs> beauty product because as y'all know, I over plucked my eyebrows when I was younger and I have a very hard time getting them to grow back. But this actually has amino acids and peptides in there. So it really helps with like the health of the hair to kind of like promote growth. And it has like a very flexible, but like a little bit of a hold. So once I fill my eyebrows in, I just kind of like brush this through. And even at nighttime when I go to the shower, once I do like my nighttime skincare, I'll brush this through my brows and just sleep in it because I want those peptides to like help these eyebrows grow back. They also have that amino acid peptide like boost system in their eyelash serum. So if you want some like healthy long lashes, I would try the eyelash serum as well. I told y'all I love my dime products. I don't even think that this is like all that I have, but definitely the ones that I reach for most often. I have probably repurchased the Super Skin Toner at least six or seven times. It is my favorite. And then I recently got the Glaze and then the Boosting Body Serum, and I have been loving those as well. So thank you so much, Dime, for sponsoring today's video. Y'all, they gave me a 20% off discount code to give you guys. So if you use code O'Donohue20, you can get 20% off anything. I'll have all my favorites linked down below. Be sure you use that discount if you're looking for great skincare beauty perfume try the perfume <laughs> definitely use my code all right so today has kind of taken a turn we have really rearranged a lot of plans in the past hour so Bunky and I are actually going to leave tonight and drive to the farm to my parents house spend the night there and that way tomorrow we have a much shorter drive because as of how it stood earlier today we had a 10 hour drive tomorrow and that was just going to be crazy so my mom and dad are leaving as well they're going to the farm Bunky and I are going to leave just a little bit later once we get everything packed. And then my brother is staying here and he's going to fly out of here tomorrow. So I'm going to make my brother some dinner tonight. It is like an easy, no fuss, just a few ingredients. And it's going to be really, really good. I think he's going to love this. It's like such a Jacob recipe. So let me show you what we're going to make. So we're going to do like these barbecue kielbasa bites. And they're just going to like um, bake in the oven until they get really sticky and kind of like this little bit of crisp on them. So I'm gonna take my kielbasa sausage and just cut it up into like, um, I don't know, half an inch little rounds, like discs. And then you're gonna take your favorite barbecue sauce. So I have some Sweet Baby Ray's here. But I'm also gonna add a little bit of Honey Hot just to give it a little extra something something. You can just use whichever is your favorite. And then you'll need some brown sugar and just a little bit of liquid smoke. I actually have never cooked with liquid smoke, but I'm excited to add it in there because I've seen a lot of people make um, baked beans with this, and so I'm excited to kind of like see what flavor it gives. I'm gonna go ahead and get these cut up. Also, side note, mom made her one cup cobbler <laughs> this morning, but she kind of like stirred everything together, which she normally doesn't, and it turned everything purple, but I kind of like it. Yummy. And everyone has said it's so good. If y'all have not made her one cup cobbler, you got to. It's delicious. So this is kind of the thickness that we're looking for. So I'm just going to add this to my baking dish. Now if you're feeding like a whole family or a bigger crowd, of course you can do more than just one little sausage. Um, and I would use like a 9 by 13. But since I'm really just feeding my brother, <laughs> I feel like this will be plenty for him. My mom's actually coming back later this week with my sister. So she said any of them that's left over, she's going to have. Y'all, I just smell that liquid smoke and it smells so good. So to our little sausages, I'm going to just top it with our barbecue sauce. And then I'll add just a few little drops of this liquid smoke and then sprinkle on some brown sugar. We're going to toss this together and pop it in the oven. Like this is one of the most simple dinner ideas that you can make. I feel like perfect for summertime. And I bet you can even do these on the grill and they would be really good. Now just into the oven at 350 for like 30 to 40 minutes until that sauce gets nice and caramelized and kind of reduces down. And then those will be ready to eat. I wish y'all could smell these because it is like we are barbecuing in here and they look so amazing. Luckily they got kind of like crispy on some of those edges. Mm, these are gonna be delicious. Now 
Now the other night we were cleaning out my fridge since we're leaving on our trip and mom made this big sheet pan of veggies and they were so good. And we kind of just like threw everything that we had on the sheet pan. I have a little bit of footage so I will insert it here, but that would be, I think, the perfect side dish to go along with these. This is a sheet pan I am excited to eat. Mom and dad are here and they brought us zucchini from their garden. And then we had some potatoes, carrots, and broccoli in the fridge. And we actually leave for our camping trip in like two days. So we need to clean out all of the things in our fridge. And so we're gonna roast this. It's gonna be so good. Mom just put some of this um, olive oil and vinegar dressing on there. And y'all know we love this stuff. It's really good if you haven't tried it. And then I sprinkled, of course, garlic herb, sea salt, and lemon. And then my bunkie, coming through with the the CPP. You know what it is. And then we're just gonna pop this in the oven like at 350 for, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes until everything's like really nice and tender. It's going to be delicious. It's like a great summer side dish, easy recipe. This turned out so good. The flavor is amazing. Mom loves it. Uh -huh. She's had a couple People plates. <laughs> <laughs> Brother Jacob, coming in. Give us the taste test. I'm a professional at this. Oh, are you gonna be better than Bunky? <laughs> now don't burn your mouth. I think they're gonna be hot. Are we in Texas? Cause that's some good burn ends right there. Ooh, wee! Tell us, flavorful, delicious barbecue sauce. You know, it it. You'd think they came out of the smoker, the way them things cooked. Oh. But they didn't. You would be surprised. It's that you little know. bit of liquid smoke. Oh, but do you look amazing. I'm gonna make a cut. Now that we got the comedian out of here, mommy, you give us your honest opinion. Mmm. I need to buy some liquid smoke. Right? Mmm. And you better come up here and try some of these before they're gone. Good. Mmm. Try three here. Try take three. Take three. Oh my God. You love them? Mm -hmm. That was so easy too. I'm telling you, I'm telling <laughs> you. Even after the third one, they just keep getting better. Ooh, I'm so glad. I shouldn't have got pizza today. Poor Bunky's going to get the RV. He'll have to have someone he gets back before we leave, but. That was really good. So good. Someone made it back. Mm -hmm. Just in time. Just in time for a snack. Yes. This one, got my eye on this one right here. That one looked good. This is like, one of my favorite things. It's all, it's given me the, uh, I don't know what all's in here yet, but you know the little cocktail weenies? Yeah. Those are, we'll just those try are it. one of my guilty pleasures. Mm, that right there, that's that's what I'm looking for in life. Everyone has <laughs> loved the liquid smoke in there. Mm -hmm. You like it too? Mm-hmm. That's so good. Look what Bunky brought back. I'm so excited. We're gonna load it up and hit the road. If you're not watching our other channel, Chasing Sunsets, I'll link it below. Be sure you go over there and subscribe. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video, but thank you for hanging out with me and my entire family. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to subscribe if you're new, give this one a thumbs up. Don't forget to check out Dime down below, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.